all right good morning oh my goodness jeez. good morning everybody um <clears throat> good morning good morning good morning mic check mic check one two mic check one two what up everybody um good morning happy freaking friday um i'm actually feeling a lot better than i was yesterday uh but my voice is still recovering um but what up everybody i probably can't just i just can't talk as loud all right <clears throat> but i'm feeling a lot better from yesterday but i just can't talk as loud Brittany, thank you so much for the 21 month re-up out and about but still tuning in shout out to Brittany for the 21 uh 21 month re-up i appreciate that Brittany. appreciate you shout out to Brittany for the 21 month re-up what up johnny what's good cushy souls in the building sounds a little better yeah a little bit better uh i just like my voice is a little cracky uh, i feel more i feel a little bit congested but i sound a I sound better than I was yesterday, but I'm still a little sick. Uh, Bad Ross, good morning, man. Good morning. Snowbird in the building, Big Ron's Kicks, Casanova Kane, Allen, Cushy Souls, what's good? Jesus, RPK, Johnny, what up, man? Um, Francisco, morning. Hope uh, you're feeling, uh, you're feeling, you're doing well, uh, well, Raph. Appreciate it. Uh, Mr. Exclusive, thank you so much for the 21 month re up. Let's have him go. Britt beat me, uh, uh Brie bit me uh beat me in the uh this re-up it's all good i think every time she sees the re-up i think it's like scheduled on a calendar or something <laughs> but uh mr exclusive i appreciate you happy friday from the west side what up nathan what up man uh you sound better than yesterday bro thank you alan appreciate that <laughs> still on my like, cough what up the craze good morning hope you feeling better my g yeah i feel better but like i said um um I feel better in the inside, if that makes sense. Like yesterday, I took like a, I drank like the tea, like the uh, thermal flu, tea, uh, thermal uh, flu tea, and I drank more tea later. And then, like, dude, I I knocked out. I freaking knocked out after that. I was like, bruh, I can't, I can't hold this in because I thought, because the th the thing about the tea, it makes me sleepy, and I thought I wasn't, I was able to. Um, to stay up but i wasn't able to stay up i hella knocked out in front of my fireplace uh what up kayla what up rami what's good bro appreciate you guys tapping in t dot i suppose big ron's kicks what's good bro um scene lover what's good robert um eddie what's good no i just have a good memory okay bomba kicks what's up oscar in the building i see you bro um well this morning i got like i got orange juice so hopefully orange juice somewhat helps uh drew good morning man good morning fam what up man thank goodness it's friday um kb what up man shout out to my boy kb in the building what's good bj in the belly what's good good morning uh them cpfms run true to size and i ain't grab my yo so what was going on with this freaking cpfms uh, everyone was talking about CPFMs, um, yesterday, how, like, I guess sizing was completely all cap. So I guess CPFMs was actually true to size. It wasn't go size and a half down. So what was going on with that? Uh, sneaker ambition. What up, man? It's Roy. Roy. What up, man? Uh, Londo, what's good? Jamie, yo, what's good, bro? Feeling better? The hoodie uh, is fire. What what brand is it? This is Richie Lee. Richie Lee brand. Um, based out of Chicago. Good morning, my bro. bro. How you doing? Uh, <clears throat> morning, bro, with um, W Stream. Uh, let's, let's hit that like button. Yeah, make sure you guys run it up if you guys don't mind, man. Make sure you guys smash that like button. Uh, that video you show lied. Yeah, I don't know what was the, um, what was going on? What was going on with the sizing, dude? <laughs> People are gonna be down bad. We will find out when it arrives. Yeah, <clears throat> I think that's the only, the only way that we'll find out whenever the people actually speak about it, right? But I don't know. Everyone was saying true to size, true to size. I don't know who made the video. Iggy, what up, man? What's good, Iggy? What up, Iggy? Um, rep selects uh, had fakes. I don't know. Seth Fowler video saying true to size, really? So Seth Fowler himself said true to size. What up, a 402 car kid? What's good, bro? What's good? I gotta look into that. I never, I didn't watch his video. I did not watch his video. I did not watch his video. <clears throat> Hold on, let me see. Yeah, he did post the video. It's released.
Oh shit, dude. I that's the one thing about hate about reviews sometimes. It's like they have some like videos like with music. It's like bruh. Let's see. Cactus plant flea market Nike Air Flea 2. Cactus plant it's Nike box uh, that you can throw on. I'm sure get their order. Out of my way to like So if you saw it in like a Nike store, you'd buy it. If I was at a store and they had these, I would get on. I wouldn't go drive anywhere. So. <laughs> I'll drive 30 minutes. If you guys could change one thing about the shoes, what would it be? I wish. I'm not saying you're a short king. I'm just saying for the short kings. <laughs> so out of all the shoes that I've showed you guys, where does this rank? This is the first time I like what you showed. As of right now, a day after release, it looks like there could be another release of this shoe, possibly on the sneakers app, but there's no confirmation of that yet. So if you missed out on these guys, you might have to pay resale for them, which right now isn't great, but it's also not terrible. And if you guys want to check out the resale price, make sure to click the link on your screen or in the description below. But Cactus Plant Flea Market has once again created something that is unbelievably insane looking. Last year we had the Nike Air Flea ones which looked like Grinch's feet and I think they were actually styled after the Grinch. This time around the brand decided to release something that looks like a mashup of the Balenciaga Defender and the- S Skip towards the end? Okay. Boots. And this just seems to be another example of the parting lines on this shoe and it seems like different parts of the midsole are glued together. So it wasn't cheap to make this midsole- What's the time stamp on this? tooling that they had to do. So uh, I don't know. I wouldn't be surprised if they drop more colorways in the future just to kind of justify the cost of the midsole, but who knows. But then finally we get to the bottom of the shoe which features- The upper is also not very brief. Fashion forward. Would I buy this shoe for retail? Yes, I definitely would. Probably not. I would probably pay max like one another pair of these in the future. I'll pay that amount. But I mean, you can see all the parting lines. Does anybody know timestamp? Come on, dude. It's a 14 minute video. Holy shit. Which is the shoe that draw people's attention are the Nike swoosh and this midsole. And I think those are the two parts of the shoe that really make you're going to get a very uh, interesting look. And you're going to get a lot of looks. It's a forfeit of the shoe, not 100% sure. So they give you a lot of options if you need them. Obviously, it's more of a stylistic thing. But hey, if you have trouble getting your shoes on, not a bad shoe to grab because you got a bunch of ways These to do it. So but then we move ugly. down on the sneaker to this insane tire looking rubber outsole that actually wraps all the way up on the midsole. So at first glance, it really looks like your foot is going to be resting on top of this midsole, the heel of the shoe right underneath your foot and possibly one toward... No, no. Are you not vibing? I'm sorry, bro. This shoe is so massive and it might ugly. Just be this solid rubber underneath your foot or maybe some sort of air cushion added heel area, but back in the Nike swoosh. So you can pull them off like this because they're different. Now, like I mentioned before, the midsole of this shoe is similar to the Balenciaga Defender, which essentially looks like they took a shoe and put a tire on the outsole. This has a very similar vibe. However, it seems to be much more of a standard traction pattern than the Balenciaga Defender. It also definitely has that Mars Yard overshoe look as well, which again, I'm not completely opposed to, but I don't know. I don't hate it. Now, for any of you watching that think that this shoe has a, uh, a function or a reason that it looks like this other than purely aesthetics, uh, that doesn't seem like that's the case. You can't tell me and you can't tell me that this shoe looks good. Dude, this shoe looks horrible. Just look at the shoe. You're literally wearing a shoe that I don't know. The shoe just looks so bad on feet, bro. I'm sorry. This shoe looks so bad on feet. Look at this. I don't know if he's wearing the wrong pants. Um, it, it does not, dude, if you looked at the view of the shoe right here, it just does not look good at all. Bro, Rav, go back to bed, my guy. No, I'm fine. <laughs> dude, they look so bad. And I, I, like I said, I don't know if it's the view of the the angle I, I don't know i don't know what it is but this is just not it it's the right pants it's just the wrong shoe yeah <laughs> yeah i couldn't wear those I need to uh, need to apologize they are they're horrendous dude these are just not it this shoe seems to be purely a uh he's not wearing long socks kind of with them he's wearing like what is that is he wearing socks shoe which is fine i think a lot of shoes that sneakerheads wear are like oh he is wearing socks it just makes it look like he's not wearing socks he's wearing like tan socks to him what up brian what's good bro
Mickey Mouse Playhouse sneakers. That, especially the big red boots. And this just seems to be another example of that, pushing boundaries in mass-produced footwear, which is kind of cool. Because when you create a shoe like this, it's not cheap to make. They have to create all new molds. It's definitely a, uh, an expensive shoe to manual, but who knows. But then finally we get to the bottom of the shoe, which is not very brief. lose a lot of money on the shoe, but, but it's not a shoe that Apothecary's website linked at the top of the description to loosen one of the straps i don't know it's i think what said fowler he should have like categories like really complicated like, either way but they definitely sizing. don't so it's kind of hard to uh to place it back in 2015 fleet 2 is just another example of C so earlier this year when we whatever i don't know where the sizing part is in the video i don't want to get into it because i don't want to look for it nor i don't want to watch the whole entire video ankle socks not it um Shoes I'll pay uh, to wear there for uh, 30 days straight. What up, out of stock kicks? What's up, dude? What up, Josh? Uh, but let's go back to uh, what's dropping this morning. Uh, we got a couple stuff dropping this morning. First thing is first, we have the SB Dunk Lows dropping this morning. <clears throat> We got SBs dropping. We got New Balance dropping. I'm not sure where New Balance is dropping at. Um, I think for the Tina J Air Force Ones, for the Tina J Air Force Ones, you're going to need, uh, I believe it was for only uh, NFT, right? NFT holders, if I'm not mistaken. I think it was for the NFT holders only, if I'm not mistaken. Um, but I think that's happening at noon. Alfredo, thank you so much for the... Uh, for the 15 month re up says, What up, Rafi? Are you copping the Tina J's today? I don't know if I, I mean, I don't think I have, I'll get, be able to get access. I don't think I'll be able to get access. I don't think I'll be able to get access for the shoe, unfortunately, uh, because I'm not the, uh, what's they call the NFT holder, I guess that you guys want to call it. Uh, morning, how you feeling, Raf? I'm feeling better. Um, just my voice is still gone a little bit. Uh, good morning, Raf and Collection Fam. Raf, hope you're feeling a little better. Appreciate you, NW. Thank you so much. Uh, y'all hated on the uh on the spikes off white Air Force Ones, but love these CPFMs. Huh? Bro, the CPFMs look ten times ten times like ten times different than the freaking Air Force One off whites. What are you what are you talking about, Gorgon? That is like a terrible comparison. That's like a terrible comparison. One first thing is first, the CPFMs in general are just straight ass. Um, off white mids, even more ass. Um, but I would say like that's two different shoes and two. That's just terrible comparison. It's just a terrible comparison. I wouldn't compare CPFMs to off white, uh, off white mids, um, Air Force Ones. The two different shoes. You going for the fogs this morning? Um, I don't know yet. I don't know if I'm going for the fogs this morning. Uh, Bob Ross of the one percent for the two dollar donation. Classic common L Gorgon. Oh my god. <coughs> um, shout outs to Bob Ross of the one percent. Um, appreciate it. It's common, uh, a common uh, L, common L, classic common L Gorgon. Need those Chicago's Air Maxes, okay? Um, yeah. So we got the SBs this morning. We got the Tiffany J, T Tina J's this morning, and then we have the New Balances this morning. So I think that's all we got. I'm comparing the hate. Um, dude, you gotta realize, all right? You gotta realize, Gorgon, is that I think with the uh, comparing the hate, I think it's because the um, the CPFMs Classic have resale. You got to realize that, man. I think it's because the shoe had resale. And I think once once the shoe, everyone gets their hands on the shoe, this is going to tank. And that's the re that's the biggest comparison, Gorgon, was the resale aspect of the shoe. And that's what I say all the time. People people go for a sneaker because of the resale aspect. People knew people knew that the Air Force 1 mids, they weren't even going for anything. So that's why people were passing on it. Uh, y'all just uh don't think logically is all is all in where you uh, see logic you attack. I mean, who's y'all, bro? Who's y'all? Who you talking about, y'all? Who's y'all, Gorgon? Who you? Who is y'all? You talking about? 
Who is y'all you talking about? Who is y'all? Y'all. Y'all just think logically. Y'all don't think logically, he says. He says, y'all. Good morning, Chris. What up, man? Um, Gorgon is the head of uh, Doofus Patrol, RPK says. Oh, gosh. The Tina Turner Air Force Ones. <clears throat> uh, oh, that makes sense. But who who do the CPFMs have resale at all? Uh, all they look, uh, all they, wait, what? Oh, that makes sense. But who do the CPFMs have resale at all? They look worse. Dude, I if I would choose the CPFMs or the Air Force Ones, if I would choose... If I would choose the CPFMs over uh, or the uh, Air Force Ones, I don't know what I would choose because they're both ugly. Both ugly. Um, are you feeling better today, Raph? Yeah, I'm feeling better. I'm feeling better, but it's just my voice is a little, a little cracky. Y'all's the hate. Y'all is all the haters in the chat. Okay. I guess. I guess Gorgon. I guess. Just dude, it, it's just because people have opinions. That's it. People just have opinions, and that's how it goes. People could say it's a, it could be the ugliest sneaker, but money talks at the end of the day, Gorgon. Okay. People would be like, oh man, it has resale value. Let me go for it. It's not necessarily that pe necessary that people want the shoe or want to wear the shoe. It's probably because it just has resale, and that's it. See, me personally, I skipped on the sneaker. I there's no way damn well I was gonna. Uh, was gonna go for the shoe. I mean, I went for them, but if I was gonna hit, I was not gonna check out. <laughs> I was like, no way, I'm getting this shoe in hand. Alfredo, thank you so much for the two. I'm actually surprised you're not on. Uh, you're not on uh, a dot swoosh. <clears throat> talking about like the the NFT holder thing, um, Alfredo. I'm talking about that. Um, I respect that money angle. Yeah, I guess so. I guess so, but the thing is, I feel like once people get their pairs in hand, I just feel like the shoe is going to tank. Um, cuz I'm sure a lot of people cuz the thing is like I don't know how the um the checkout was going that that went. I didn't get a checkout link. Uh I did sign up, but I didn't get a checkout link, but I guess they send you like an invoice or something like that and then you press the link and then you check out or something like that. So some people were giving their links away. Like I know, um, uh, I know the homie Dre. Dre gave uh had two links and he gave away uh the links for free. So if anybody wanted them, they just forward them the email to somebody that wanted them and then they copped. Uh yo Malcolm, thank you so much for the five month re-up. Sub twin, get well soon. I appreciate that, yo Malcolm. I appreciate it, man. Thank you so much. Appreciate that, yo, Malcolm. Shout out to my boy, yo, Mal yo Malcolm, for the five-month re-up. Hey, yo, Collection fam, what's good? Uh, Rafi, hope you're feeling better. Yeah, I'm feeling a little better, like I said. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Shout out to my boy, yo, Malcolm, with the re-up, man. I appreciate that. <coughs> um, uh, Morning, Rafi. I got EA. Oh, yeah, who got EA yesterday? Who got exclusive access yesterday? I heard exclusive access, exclusive access yesterday was cap. I heard EA was capped yesterday. Alfredo, thank you so much for the two dollar donation. Yeah, the NFT Nike. I'm copping for the uh, for the toe. There you go. Yeah, those uh, those Tina J's. Those that definitely grew on me, dude. Those those grew on me heavy. Those grew on me. Those uh, those Tina J's. I kind of want a pair low key, but I think they're gonna go for a lot. Uh, dot, but the uh, dot swoosh was NFT event. Well, that was supposed to give you ex exclusive access. Yes, so that's the only way that you're gonna be able, um, you're gonna be able to uh to cop if you are a uh, basically an NFT holder uh for the dot swoosh. Uh, thanks for responding logically, Raph. Yeah, man, it's all good. It's all Gucci, man. I mean, like I said, Gorgon, you have an opinion like everybody else does, right? Um. Uh, let's see. The Royals were not selling out. Were they sitting? Dude, a lot of people got EA yesterday. A lot of people. A lot of people got exclusive access yesterday to the Royals. It's crazy because, like, 
there was a lot of people that actually hit on the white cement Jordan threes and the Royals, or excuse me, the the uh, satins or the patents, and still got EA. I didn't get EA yesterday. Yeah, the NFT Nike. Um, I'm coping for the toe. They will open it up uh, for all Dot Swoosh members after. Okay. Yeah, but if they do open it up after the Dot Swoosh members, it's it's all going to get sold out probably. Like the demand for the Tina J's Air Force Ones are pretty high. Like a lot of people actually like it. I like it a lot too. Like it's definitely grown on me. I've watched, uh, I was like looking at more pictures and like as I was looking at more pictures, um, the shoe was growing on me pretty heavy. I'm not going to lie. Um, <clears throat> should I sell my UNC toes? It's up to you. Uh, I have the EA for the Tina J's on the uh, fence. I think you. I think it sent you an email. I think you. I think they sent you an email. If uh, I think it's like exclusive access, and I think it starts at nine, nine a.m. PST, twelve Eastern time for the um for the drop for the Tina J's. So if you're interested in that, I think that's gonna be at noon Eastern time. As in the Royals, copping with uh, JD twenty dollars uh, rewards. Yeah. Sounding better today, Rap. Appreciate that. Uh, King James, appreciate my guy. Thank you so much. Hey, I'm feeling a little better. Uh, if you uh if you won if you won the Tina J's, don't sell them. They said you will you will access store drops and other events with your shoes. That's actually pretty cool, dude. It's actually pretty cool. Hoping I could get the Tina J's in a size 15 so I could get them for my Bigfoot nephew. There we go. Should I sell my body in Tokyo for SBs? Ben C said. Yo, Ben, hopefully you're enjoying Japan, bro. For real, for real. Hopefully you're out there enjoying Japan. Buenos Dias, collection fam. What up, Deleon? What's good, bro? Appreciate you tapping in, man. Shout out to my boy Deleon in the building. Uh, Raph, is the John Morant ones Halloween drop today, too? Is there? John Morant? What? Ravi, the John Morant ones halloween dropped today too uh where is that at is it dropping on finish line check silver stripes what up man how you doing my guy appreciate you tapping in the jaw ones is dropping today where at where's the jaw ones dropping i'm not a big fan of jaw the jaw morants nor i'm not a big fan of his game either uh what up rav what up chevy rise what's good bro how you doing man um it's my first night here it's 9 30 uh 9 36 p.m Jeez, it's late over there. It's 9.36 p.m. in Tokyo. <clears throat> well, that's cool. So that means you got to, like, wait another two hours for the drops. Um, It's his first night, Cushy. It's his first night. The jaws are dropping on the foot sites at 10 a.m. Okay, shout out to my boy, Go and Ghost. So I'm assuming finish line and JD Sports this morning. Most likely will be I have an EA, not EA, but um a Q that will go up. I just copped the Air Force Ones, uh, Tina J's. <laughs> I don't know about you guys, but I like the Tina J's. I don't know how much they're going for. Someone said in the chat, I think it was the family man that came in here, was saying that the Tina J's had a lot of resale, but I don't know. I don't know. I think this Air Force One is going to be only for the toe. <clears throat> Last sale was 243. Yeah, I think this is only going to be for the toe. This is a nice shoe. I really like the, I really like, what I like about the shoe is the uh, the bottom of the sole. I like that blue translucent uh, icy sole on the bottom. I think they're really, really nice. Rav, when you, uh, when you pay resell, what platform do you buy from? If I pay resell, um, go, mostly Goat App, StockX. I, I want to give uh, eBay a shot, but it just depends just depends on price i basically go based off pricing man like if i could get it cheaper on stock x and i'll go stock x if i could get it cheaper on like goat then i go goat <clears throat> i got access in the tina j's i'm copping them there you go going ghost congrats yeah teenage tina j's should be cool if you're able to go for the tina j's um i think that's a w uh tina j's this is not a jpeg how we feeling today? What up, Alex? We're feeling all right, man. We're feeling better from yesterday for sure. Uh, gonna try to cop them. All right. So the TDJs are really, really nice. And like I said, that's gonna go live at nine. I'm not sure when New Balance is dropping. Um, I think New Balance is dropping. Where's? Does anybody know where New Balance is dropping at this morning? 
I don't know if they're dropping on the New Balance website. I think it's the um the is it the khakis? What is this? I don't know when they're dropping. Here it is. It is on New Balance. What's today's date? The 20th? Yeah, they're dropping on New Balance this morning. It's these. The car hearts, not the khakis. The car hearts. It's these. The car hearts, New Balance, made in US, 990s V6. These are dropping this morning. If anybody's interested, I got access, but I'm passing. Are the Air Force Ones true to size or true? I would say go true to size on Air Force Ones. For me, for me, Air Force Ones, I, they run true to size. In my personal opinion, they run true to size. So that's my personal opinion, though. So you can do whatever you want, but me personally, I'm go. I would say go true to size on Air Force Ones. True to size on Air Force Ones. Uh, I need them to uh, need them as beasts today too. Let me know in the chat. <clears throat> Let me know in the chat. What are you guys going after today? Thank goodness it's Friday, by the way. If you guys don't mind, smash that like button. If you're ghost watching today, uh, let it be known. If you're ghost watching today, let it be known today. If you're ghost watching, uh, I appreciate you regardless. If you're ghost watching, man, I appreciate you guys supporting as always, right? Thank you guys so much, ghost watchers in here. Um, thank you so much for always tapping in as always. Um, link to the Air Force Ones on sneakers. I think I think you have to have an I think there's like a direct link on an email via email. You have to have a night like you have to be one of those uh Nike swoosh work. I don't know exactly where they're gonna be dropping, but I'm pretty sure it's gonna be on the uh the Nike app, right? For the Tina J's. Does anybody know exactly when the Tina J's are dropping? Like where at? Um $100, I'll go for you on Tina J's. Wait, what? $100, and I'll go for you on Tina J's, Parham says. What? Um, Let's get it, my, uh, my hoi, 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 hoi. Get it in the email. Shout out to all my ghost watchers in the building. Make sure you guys run it up. Smack that like button. Like I said, I appreciate you guys tapping in as always, man. I need them CP, uh, CP3s, Jamie said, next week. Those drop on the 24th, I think, right? Let's drop on the 24th. It's on sneakers app. Okay. It's on sneakers app this morning. Oh yeah. EA only. EA only. Raph, I, I can try uh try for you. Uh, I have a two swoosh accounts. I'll go for you on the other if you want. No, it's all good, Mr. Exclusive. It's all Gucci, my guy. I appreciate your offer. I appreciate it. If I get it, I get it. If I don't, I don't. Um Tina J's are dropping as EA at 12 p.m. Eastern time. Go and go says. On the Nike sneakers app. Uh, ben C, thank you so much for the 21-month re-up. I'm buying SBs and Pokemon, he says. <coughs> uh, ben C, thank you so much for the 21-month re-up. He says he's buying SBs and Pokemon. Uh, crew, what up, man? How you feeling, dog? I'm feeling all right, man. I'm feeling better from yesterday. Um, just my voice is a little a little cracky. Uh, feels like I'm going through puberty, but you know, I'm still, I'm, I'm feeling all right. Feeling 10 times better than I was yesterday. All I did was sleep all freaking day. I slept like I slept in the morning and then I woke up, watched Cruz live for a little bit. And then I drank some tea again and I knocked that out. So it was definitely a, uh, a very, 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 very long day for sure. Um, it's Spider-Man day today. Where's Rob at? Yeah. Who got the Spider-Man game? Dude, Tona was waiting for that all night. If you guys were able to, uh, if you guys bought the Spider-Man game, let us know. I know that released last night to anyone that is a big fan of Spider-Man, Spider-Man, Spider-Man. Uh, if you were able to play that game, there you go. I think that went live last night too. Farm says check Twitter. Okay. Check Twitter. Check Twitter. Check Twitter. COVID, COVID, go, go. Oh my gosh. Uh, let's see. Right here. Uh, this is the email. This is the email. Alfredo, thank you so much for the two. The uh RT, the RTFKT dunks are are a must cop next year. Okay. I don't know what that is. I I don't think I've seen that one. Um, Alfredo, I don't think I've seen that one. Tell my boy Alfredo for the two dollar donation. Alfredo, thank you so much, my guy. So, congrats, you revealed one of the more um OF1 boxes on swoosh dot swoosh before 1016, which means you're eligible for the upcoming Air Force One. Low Tina J's release, Tina J's drops at 10 20 at 12 p.m. Eastern Time, 9 a.m. PST for $120 only on the Nike sneakers app. 
So they're dropping on the sneakers app. Shout out to Parm. This is the email that you were uh, getting. There it is. What up, Big Josh? What's good, bro? Lanessa, Lanessa, thank you so much for the 10 month re up. I appreciate that, Lanessa. I appreciate that. All right. Shout out to my uh, homegirl, Lanessa. I appreciate that for the 10 month re up. Shout out to my girl, Lanessa. Appreciate that. Um, let's see. Um, Yo, what is going on? Why you guys keep fighting in the chat, bro? Why you guys arguing in the chat? Yo, everything okay? What's going on? Y'all need to y'all need to get some uh boxing gloves, bro. You out here ding 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 ding. Uh you have to open a box to to qualify, not just uh uh not just own one. Um morning y'all. What's good? Good morning. Travis Gull for uh, 600 should I cop now or wait? It's up to you, bro. If you want to spend the money, that's all. That's totally up to you. You guys are out here arguing with each other. Toxic Friday. Thank goodness it's Friday. Jesus. Hug it out, y'all. Yeah, hug it out, bro. It's Friday, y'all. What are you guys doing? Hug it out. It's Friday. You feel me? It's Friday. Unexpectable for a Friday. Yeah, I know. Unacceptable, he says. Unacceptable. Um, a morning graphing collection fam. How are you feeling today? What up, Breezy Smalls? I'm feeling better. I'm feeling better, man. It's just like I'm just it's just my voice. That's it. It's hard for me. It's I feel like I'm struggling to talk. That's why I feel like it. Like I don't I can't talk as normal as I want to, but it's like if I try to force my voice out, like I'm I could feel like my voice wanting to crack. <laughs> But I'm feeling a lot better. The Appreciate RTFKT it. dunks are must cop for next year. <coughs> Sparkles. Uh, morning, fam. How, uh... The what? Jaguar ro ro roars? Wait, what? Uh, Parm, the better invoice seller, uh, clears what? Oh, my gosh. You guys just... Come on. All right? Come on. Come on, guys. All right? It's spooky season. See, if I try to force my voice out, my voice ends up cracking. Sorry. I'm going through puberty. Uh, shoes over uh, those all day, Philip says. Oh, my gosh. Dude. I don't know, dude. This week has been low-key weird, man. This week has been low-key weird, man. Seriously. This week, I'm not going to lie. This week has been weird. I don't know. I have a, like a, a, a tingling feeling behind my head that it's just a weird week. A weird, weird week. Um, bro, what time do you uh, usually wake up? Must be early AF for you. I wake up like around 4.30, 4.15, 4.30. Try to get my morning uh, ready before the stream. And then I start up my stream at 5.10 every day. Uh, Drewski. Drewski, Brewski. Thank you so much for the one month re-up, my guy. I appreciate it. Bru uh, Drewski. Make sure you connect your YouTube account into Discord, all right? Make sure you're doing so, all right? If you guys join the membership, click that link that's above. Support the channel, um, and then you get those benefits in the Discord group. So make sure you are connecting your YouTube account into Discord, all right? Appreciate you, uh, Drewski Brewski. Thank you so much for the one-month re-up. Guys, it's Friday. Let's all get along and celebrate the weekend. Dude, I'm excited for this weekend, bro. I'm hoping that I could get through, like, Friday and get my voice back by tomorrow because I need to get out the house, dude. I need to get out the house, dude. <clears throat> I don't want to stay indoors tomorrow because I've been staying. I've been, I haven't been. really been doing anything in the last two weekends, all right? <clears throat> Bob, do I care, y'all? Salty, bro. Go make yourself. Oh my gosh, dude. You guys need to talk. Y'all need to, y'all need to like, y'all need to hug it out. Y'all need to hug it out, bro. Oh my gosh, y'all. You guys need to hug it out. Everyone chillax. All right, chillax. Chillax. Everyone chill. Jeez. Chill, chill, chill. It's like mods, it's like mods, mods, mods versus mods. Jeez. What's going on? Moderator shouldn't even moderator shouldn't even bump in heads. You guys are crazy. Moderator shouldn't even be bumping heads. What's wrong with you guys? I've never seen this in a in a long time. Moderators bumping heads. 
I thought they were playing, bro. It don't look like they're playing, bro. Corey D says, let's get negative. Um, <laughs> some of you guys going to get sent to the gulag, bro. Uh, NW says, the girls are fighting. I don't know, bro. It does make for an entertaining uh, entertaining morning. Yeah, watching the moderators freaking like go at it. Uh, <laughs> How about the Mastros? I haven't really been watching um I haven't really been watching um uh, anything on baseball to be honest. Uh no, nah, private selection scammed everybody. That's what people were saying that like private selection got the uh, sizing wrong. That's what they were saying, Param. We were kind of talking about it this morning, how, like, the sizing for the uh, CPFMs was completely wrong. So I don't know who's right. I The thing is, we're not going to find out until everyone gets their pairs in. But the thing is, everybody's foot is different, and you guys got to realize that. Everybody's foot is different. Like, like I said, when we watched the private selection video... Like Scotty, he went a size and a half down, and then oh boy, Ian went two two sizes down. That's it. <coughs> what up, G Phase? Good morning, my friend. Appreciate you tapping in. What up, G Phase? What's good, bro? Raph, I got the UPC one fifty one for eighty five each. Okay. Um, y'all know if it was real smoke, um. No worries, folks. Just talking smack. All right. Uh, good morning, brother Rafi. Glad you're feeling better. What up, El Migos, man? I appreciate you, my boy. Um, I'm a trained sneakerhead assassin, uh, Delion says. Never trust no one with the fat feet on God, but luckily I went true to size. I guess so. I guess so. Hope you're feeling better, bro. Yeah, G Face, I appreciate it. I'm uh, I'm not 100, percent but I'm I'm getting there. But I really do appreciate you guys. I mean, oh boy, uh, uh, Ian, the size of a boat anchor and shaped like a chicken nugget. I don't know why we were listening to them in uh, LMAO. I mean, I I mean, I think the reason why people are listening to them because they were like the only ones that made a video and talked about it. Like, like I said, everybody's foot's different, right? Everybody's foot's different. Everybody's foot's different. Right. Everybody's foot's different. That's why I told you guys, use your own judgment. Like, you know what I mean? Like, if you want to go a whole size down or two size down, that's up to you. You know, like it, that's why it's like it's hard for me to give sizing like guide, like advice, because everybody's feet are all different, man. It's all different, bro. Everybody's feet is different. Uh, do you have the stock numbers for the fogs? Oh, stock numbers for the fogs. Uh, let's see. The fogs, uh, stock numbers are 40,000 on the fogs. 40,000. 40,200 on the fogs. 40,000. Uh, all right, y'all start, um, start Puka or Mike Evans this weekend. I still haven't decided yet. Me personally, if I would choose their, um, if I would choose, I'm going Puka, bro. I'm sorry. I'm starting Puka this week. If I would have to choose either or, I'm starting Puka. Yeah, Ian size is, uh, is a really a 10, but he's huge, so he needs a 13. Uh, imagine that they did, uh, did it to keep people away from the bigger sizes. I don't know, bro. I really don't know. I don't know if that's even a conspiracy where like, oh, they just did that so people could stay away from the bigger sizes. I don't know. Where are the lost and founds restock happening at? Huh? What? Where are the lost and founds restock? Bro, what? what? Where did you hear lost and founds, bro? There's no lost and founds dropping this morning. Bro came in here asking about Lost and Founds restock. Buenos dias, Rafi. How you feeling today? What up, Jay Bays? I'm feeling all right, man. Appreciate you asking, my guy. Appreciate it. Derek Carr is trash. Yeah, Derek Carr is... No, Derek Carr is not trash, bro. It's that 87 that should have caught that ball. But Derek Carr should have never threw a pick six. 
That's true, too, as well. Dude, Kamara gave me 39 points, bro, last night. Kamara gave me 39 points. Travis Etienne gave me 28. Bro, I'm sitting at like 65 points on fantasy football, I think. I'm sitting at, I'm sitting real good on fantasy football right now. Like, look at this shit. Hold on, let me show you guys real quick. Sniper kick said it. Oh, my God. Sniper kicks and sniper kicks even said there was EA yesterday for the cherry 12s. But that shit didn't happen. Um, that's where I'm sitting at right now. 28. Oh, or is it 25 points from Travis Etienne and 38 for Kamara? 65 points. Exactly. I'm sitting on. And I have Jared Goff. I got Puka, DJ Moore, Travis Kelsey, Keenan Allen. I'm five and one in this league. Hey, look, Team Rafi collects dubs, baby. Let's go. This is like my important league that I want to win. Uh, <clears throat> let's see. Uh, Hibbets had a uh, little restock a couple days. Dude, G-Face, you, did you see my record on uh, Wolfpack League? Do you see my Wolfpack League? Dude, I'm 5-1 and one and I have Travis. I didn't realize I was 5-1 and one in that league, in the Wolfpack League. I'm five and one. And I have both Travis Etienne and Kamara on that league. I'm five and one in that in the Wolfpack League, dude. That's dude crazy. And I still got Tyreek Hill, Mark Andrews in that. Oh man. Um <clears throat> let's see. Um he must be lost. Someone go find him. Oh, gosh. Uh, super team. Yeah. If Danny Moore didn't say it, it's not official, oh, leave him alone. Bro, I'm down bad in that league. I'm one in five. Big trash. Yo, G-Face, trade me, bro. Let's do some trades, bro. G-Face, let's do some trades. I'm five and one in my league as well. There you go. Crouton is like six and oh, bro. I don't know, like, I seen Crouton in that league, in the Wolfpack League, bro. I don't know how he's 6-0 with the team that he has. Insane. I don't think I went up against Crouton yet, if, if I'm not mistaken. I don't know if I did or not. But the man is stacked. Uh, any stock numbers? Uh, 40,000 for the SBs, if anybody's interested. SBs, they're dropping, SBs, they're dropping 40,000 pairs on this this morning. 40,000. Um, don't trade your team as Gucci. Okay, I just don't want Sutton, bro. I don't know if Sutton can make me far, go uh, could go far for me. We'll see. Um, <clears throat> I'm taking him down this week. Mister Exclusive says, "Oh, uh, you talking about Crouton? I hopefully, bro. He needs to lose at least one, dude. Yeah, I don't know what I don't, dude. I'm in five leagues, bro. I, I haven't been paying attention, dude. I my my." My league in Roscoe's is clip, bro. I lost Nick Chubb. I'm clip, bro. I'm two and four in his league. I think I'm two and four. And the other league in the collection room, I'm that's the other twenty five dollar league. I'm like I'm two and four as well, bro. That shit's clip, dude. I lost Nick Chubb, dude. That was like the biggest headache, dude, of 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 losing. You hit on those Royals? No, I did not. I did not hit on those Royals. Um, drop Sutton gets down from the uh from the Colts. I mean, I don't know, man. We'll see, bro. We'll see. I'm gonna. Well, Sutton is the guy out there in uh in Denver. So I mean, he's the wide receiver one. <clears throat> he needs his first L. Well, sometimes just because you have the best record, you know, sometimes we've seen like good records go down in the playoffs. So you just never know, dude. Once playoffs rolls around in fantasy football, the entire the entire game changes. It does. I was I was second best last year on Wolfpack uh last year and I lost. You know what I'm saying? So like or no, I was fourth best. It was like it was like uh what's his name? Chubba Hubba, whatever. And Rob was number two, and I think I was four. And I end up beating I end up beating uh I end up we I think both of them end up losing the like two the two top uh best uh uh fantasy uh league uh records they both lost from the third and fourth place uh guys so it's like you just never know man you just never know playoffs makes a huge difference 
You going for the fogs? Um, I don't know yet. I don't know. I don't know if I'm going for the fogs this morning. I don't know. Uh, Kamara helping six and oh, dude. Kamara has been a huge, oh, was probably the best investment that I did on fantasy football. If you picked up Kamara and if you picked up uh, Cooper Cup on fantasy football, dude, those two guys were like the best, best investments on fantasy football, hands down. I don't care what anyone says. Um, Boy, Raph, sound better today. Brian, appreciate it, man. I just can't try to force my voice out. If I if I force my voice out, my voice is gonna start cracking. So I can't I can't force it. Um we'll go for a 13. Uh we'll go for a 13 for me. Mr. Cruz, if you need these in a 13, you need these in a 13. 40,000 pairs, 40,000 size 13 he needs. 2035. I'll go for a size 13. Size 13. Mr. Exclusive says 6 and 0 right now. There you go, Assad. Uh, Moster probably. Oh, I have Moster in one of my leagues. That was clutch. Um, you was hurting a few weeks, but then uh coming up uh coming up clutch now. Yeah. <coughs> Joel. Oh, that hurt. Joel, thank you so much for the five. Rafi collects memberships in the chat. What up, Chalupa? What's good, bro? Shout out to my boy, Joel, for the five. Rafi collects memberships in the chat, man. We appreciate that, my guy. There you go. Shout out, shout out to my boy, Joel, for the five. Rafi collects memberships in the chat. If you guys are getting a membership, Make sure you guys are connecting your YouTube account into Discord, all right? Make sure you guys are doing so, all right? We got about one more hour until the SBs are dropping. You feeling better, Raph? Um, uh, I'm feeling all right. I'm feeling a little bit better. Feeling a little bit better. I probably have to take more medicine after this stream. Um, so, um, but yeah, I appreciate that, Chalupa. Uh, morning, Raph. What up, Lunchbox? Shout out to my boy. Oh, God, see, if I try to force my voice out. Well, shout out to my boy, Lunchbox. What's good, bro? How you doing, my friend? Appreciate you tapping in this morning. How you doing, man? It's Friday, dude. I'm feeling great. Morning, bro. Um, How you living, my man? What up, Jake B? What's good, my boy? Jake B, we need to talk soon, bro. Yo, you got openings, Jake B, or what? How's Vegas, bro? Shout out to my boy, uh, Jake B in the building. How's Vegas, my guy? I had in those Royals yesterday. I want to see how uh, how they am in hand to decide whether or if I really like them or not. See, that's the thing about the Royal Jordan 1 Highs chat is that, like, like, the shoe is not bad, okay? Going back to the Royal Jordan 1s, like, the shoe is not bad. And I'm glad that people are going for the shoe because they actually want the sneaker. Like, this shoe is already going for under retail, dude. Under retail, <clears throat> uh one day Ravi will go for me on a sneaker, Rami says. Rami, I thought you already have the shoe. Rami, I thought you already have the fogs. Rami. Rami, I thought you already have the I I thought you already have the shoe. Did you buy the shoe for like 130 or something? Where is it? Royal Jordan 1 reimagines. 230 last 232. Someone said these were going under retail, dude. Sounds of the craze. Sounds <clears throat> <clears throat> of the craze for the 20 month re ups is four months till mags. Yes, sir. Air mags, bruh. Shout out to my boy, DeCraze, for the 20-month re-up. We appreciate it, my guy. Thank you so much. Yeah, we got to catch up. Uh, Vegas is cool. Ace has just won back-to-back -back WNBAs. I saw that. I, you know what? Respectfully, uh, respectfully, uh, Jake B., no offense to the city of Vegas, but I didn't know Vegas had a women's basketball team. I personally did not know that. So, no, try to, no disrespect, okay? I just didn't know they had a WNBA team. Sneaker mommy, what up, sneaker mommy? How you doing? I'm also sick today. Uh, sneaker mom says, yeah, it, this the sickness is going around in the Pacific Northwest. I think it's the weather change for sure. They were going for two hundred dollars um yesterday. 
I don't know why so much people hate this shoe, bro. Jordan 1s are... I don't know, man. I don't know, man. I just feel like with the Jordan 1s, bro, it's just... I don't know what happened. I don't know what happened. Vegas has the uh, women's basketball as the women's basketball team. Yeah, I don't... I don't... I didn't know that. Uh, I didn't know they went back to back. Yeah, I, pfft, listen, I didn't know either, bro. Hey, I also have uh uh they also have a pickleball team. I, <laughs> I didn't know that. Everyone's at Governor's um running. Um right, right now I uh, recover, but my wife is still down bad. Uh because they look uh, like mids with the uh the suede. What? What up, B Smitty? It's all the colorway mixed with the uh, frag, uh, uh, with the uh, fabrics and uh, with fabrics they use. That could be it too. That could be it too. And I think if this was leather, I think with the uh, reimagines, if this was leather, I think it would have been a different story with the shoe for sure. If this shoe was leather, all right. If this shoe was all leather, then I think it would have been a different shoe. We're going to have another city parade probably on Tuesday, Jake B says. Are you going? B, B. Lewis says, who cares? We watch real sports. Oh, my gosh. All right, don't disrespect the woman's sports, all right? We're not going to sit here and disrespect the woman's sports chat, all right? Let's not do that, okay? Let's not do that, okay? We're not going to disrespect the woman's sports all right, we're not gonna do that. I got EA hella late yesterday. Thank you to all that uh, that passed. I don't hate them, but the these uh, these and the breads should have been done like the uh, lost and founds. I I I probably agree with you. And like I said, like this would have been a different outcome if they kind of made it similar to like the lost and founds. In my personal opinion. And I think the suede, the the suede, the 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 material that they put on here just wasn't it. And you know what I'm saying? And and I think that's how people kind of felt with the satins. You feel me? Um is 20k on the fogs accurate? Just waking up. Uh 40k straight to toe. 40,000. 40,000 is the uh is the move 40,000 40,000 y'all love woman but hating low-key facts um if these were mostly leather with the small of the suede it would have been sell out immediately i don't know i don't know i mean if it was like you know suede in the in the back of the heel and everything else was leather i i don't know if anybody would look at this shoe any different maybe because I don't know. I don't know. It's tough because I don't know why Nike has to do this whole reimagined BS. Just keep it original. I don't know. Uh, the Royals aren't even that bad. It's not a bad shoe. Uh, you know what I'm saying, Tona? It's not a bad shoe at all. It's just I think the Jordan one. And I'm telling you guys, like, StockX and GOAT plays a huge factor in this situation. And that's why, like, I always, I know it's not a really big deal because it's just at the end of the day, it's just Jordans and shoes. But, like, I just don't know what happened with the Jordan 1, bro. You know what I mean? 18K pairs on the Tina J's, according to my group, Parham says. Okay, 18,000 pairs. Okay. Like,. Like Jordan 4, like no offense. I feel like the Jordan 4 wave is like slowing down a bit. Would you guys agree? Is the Jordan 4 wave slowing down? Cause what's the recent Jordan 4 that we got? We got the Jordan 4, the uh the those silver women's exclusives, which sold out. Um, we had those red cement Jordan 4s. So like they obviously all sold out, right? What is it that, like, people lose interest into a sneaker, like a silhouette, you know? Bro, they keep uh, giving us BS colorways. <laughs> Not true, or Tina J's. Um, Lucian said 140K. 
just wait till next year on the fours yeah i mean next year we got what the blue the blue the blue uh blue military fours um we got the jordan four breads and it kind of goes back to the topic that we talked about it's just because we just live like this year has just been weird when it comes to sneakers bro like bro look at have you did you guys hear <coughs> um I don't know if anybody knows or been around knowing bots and stuff like that, but Wrath, Wrath, I think that's what it's called, Wrath, am I saying that right? All shoes are down except collabs. It's all great to be a, a buyer right now. Exactly, Hector, big facts so though. It's, it's a great time to be a buyer right now. Like the botting system, Wrath, they officially are shutting down, bro. Did you guys hear about that? I don't know if you guys are familiar of of botting or anybody that bots, but Wrath's been around for like, dude, it's been around for a long time. I think since, if I'm not mistaken, they've been around for about seven, six years, I think. If, I, if I'm not mistaken, I think they've been around for a while. And they, I guess they officially made an announcement that they are officially shutting down. Like, they're officially shutting down the entire botting business uh for wrath i mean i know there's different different bots that you could use but specifically them like they're one of the best probably the best botting system i think out there um so it's just at that point whenever a um a, a botting system uh, you know officially wants to you know shut down it just it means something right it kind of means something i don't know if it's worth botting anymore at some at some point it's not going to be worth botting which is good for the community because then it like you feel me so I, any normal consumer could try to you know buy stuff from a website like for instance like when we were when we were copping yeezys uh back in august look how easy it was to go through snipes when do we ever get through on snipes when it comes to any yeezys uh, Breezy Smalls was like one of the first people in here was saying, yo, they got a full size run on, on, on Snipe. Everyone go check Snipe, go check Snipe. You feel me? And like that website used to get so botted, um, like a year ago. And now in 2023, all of a sudden you could get through the website Snipes. Like it's crazy to me. You feel me? Like, what happened to Hibbits? What's going on with Hibbit Sports? Is Hibbit Sports, like, shut down or something? Like, what what happened with Hibbit Sports? Spider, thank you so much for the three-month re-up. Uh, Don Julio and Kitty, uh, for me tonight, get better soon. Shout out to my boy, uh, Spider, for the three-month re-up, man. Appreciate it, my guy. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Like, what happened to Hibbit Sports? Dude, we're just living in a, in a different a different like this year has been so different it's been weird it's been different uh for a lot of people um but it's it's i feel like i don't know if it's it's we're i don't know i don't want to say people are desperate right now um but i don't know um i see uh backdoor again i mean backdooring has been around for years and it still happens. It still happens. Bro, I know a reseller, a big reseller right now that already has the Alma Manier Jordan 5s. A reseller that I know that is really reliable has the Alma Manier Jordan 5s already. Like, we we used to never really see any Alma Maniers. Dude, are we getting to that point, chat? Like, seriously. Like, look at the big picture now, chat. Look at the big picture. Look at the big picture right now. Why are there so much backdooring happening right now? Why? Why? Why are boutique stores? Why why is skate shops heavy on backdooring right now? Why is why is it why is backdooring so heavy right now in 2023? Why? Okay. I mean, I'm not saying people are desperate. But like some businesses are probably hurting. Retail businesses are hurting, man. People don't want to go in, ca you know, casually go in stores and buying and buying shit. You feel me? Hope you get uh, well, uh, get well soon. I appreciate that. 
The black pair for Amal Manir Jordan 5s is not it. Yeah, I'm not a big fan of the black pair at all. Because people are buying early pairs is the uh is the only way for people to make money. Um Um What's it? Wait, what? It says, uh, yo, I guess you don't want to talk about it, bro. I asked you straight up, bro. What's the truth about the Travis Scott golfs? I asked you three times now, bro. Need to know if you're, uh, if you're, uh, if you're real. Bro, listen, if you just watch the, uh, the tripping video, because it probably got recommended to you. Like I said, I, I said my, I said my side about it. Um, I'm, the thing is like, if you tap into the stream every single day, right? I'm not going to repeat myself, okay? If you want to go back a couple streams and hear my explanation explanation about uh about the the tripping video, you could go watch it, but the thing is, I can't sit here and keep repeating myself over a pair of shoes. All right? That's the thing. All right, it's 2023. All right? Like <laughs> Uh, did you get back door to Travis Scott? They hit me up. They hit me up. They hit me up. They asked. They 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 appreciate the support. Um, yeah, I mean, I don't know. And they hit me up and they asked me for a size if I needed. I wanted a size, and they I sent my email, and that was it. And they they uh, sent me an invoice. That's that's what it was. That's what it was. Straight up. Um, I only got one pair. Um, I didn't get 50 pairs. I don't have 30 pairs. I don't got 20 pairs. I don't got 60 pairs. Okay. Do I wish I had that many pairs? Um, sure. But I only got one, unfortunately. So if that helps, I don't know what to tell you. Um, I know, you know what I'm saying? Like, that's why I said no offense on, you know, tripping. Um, but that's his content, right? He calls out people. He doesn't like, when he doesn't like someone's content, he makes content out of it. Um, and, you know, that's just how his content goes. So, but other than that, I mean, one pair. There you go. If you watch my content, you know I'm not a reseller. You know, I don't, I don't buy. Um... You feel me? This is a one-time incident that this happened, and that was it. I don't know what to tell you. Um, if you are upset, um, so why did you pretend then pointless? It wasn't. I listen. I didn't pretend. Okay, like the whole. I I personally think like watching. Like I watched the video. I just feel like the video was out of content. That's the thing, because. It just made it worse. That's why I told you guys I was put in a weird situation. But the thing is, like, the content made it worse because my internet went down, and it really did. And the thing is, they I didn't check my phone that they hit me up until, like, right after, right after my internet went down. But I didn't get an invoice until after the stream was ended. So, because the thing is, I was they were asking me if I end up getting an email. I said, no, I didn't get anything. And I didn't want to believe it until I saw it. That's the thing. Because I was, I was, I had never got hit up by anybody, a brand like this. Never got hit up by a brand like that at all. And I, it was one of those incidents where like, man, I'm not, I'm not going to believe it until I saw that shit. So it was definitely one of those situations. But at the end of the day, it's, I mean, if, if people are going to get, I get, I think people are more upset the more of the principle of it. That's the thing. So. I don't know. It's probably because people are just now watching it. Like my dad texted me. My dad texted me. He's like, who's tripping? And I was like, man, if my dad is getting recommended a video from his, that's when you know there's something wrong here. But my dad, my dad didn't care. So, um, um, will you make everyone think you were trying to cop live? I don't care about people. Um, I don't care about people are tripping. Yeah, it's all good. It is what it is. <clears throat> yeah, I don't know. People keep asking and I just keep bringing it up, whatever. So it is what it is. So, um, uh, so what's, uh, so what are we, they doing now? So that's what they're doing now. Yeah, I guess. Oh, I don't know. Like I said, I don't take control of their inventory. 
I hope that happens again for uh for yeah. If it listen, if they if it happens again, I mean I'll tell you guys. Hit me up. Um due to us, if more people cop, no one would be mad. People misdirect hate at the uh creators because the companies are messing every uh everyone over. Yeah. <laughs> I need more orange juice. No, I think people that are, I think people that have been watching my content for a while are probably tired of it. <laughs> people are just over the content, bro. You feel me? People are just over the content. And I totally get it. <clears throat> um... As long as someone from the collection family hits, everyone hits fats. Make sure you guys run it up, though. Smack that like button. Smack that like button. Smack that like button. But the thing is, like, we're just in a, it's a weird time when it comes to sneakers, man. You know what I mean? I just feel like... I just feel like me personally, like, when it comes to sneakers, I don't know if because... We talked about this last time. That, like collabs have been taking over the sneaker game but this year i don't know what really carried this year in in 2023 i think sb's low-key kind of carried spin thank you so much for the two rap i'm happy you hit the travis by the way feel better shout out to my boy spin thank you so much for the two dollar donation i appreciate that spin <clears throat> what up spin um bro the issue should be take your re uh take off to the resellers that got full size runs of the shoes and don't see uh don't see the same energy. Yeah. Trivium just made you more popular, Raf. Yeah, I don't that's why I don't care, bro. I, you guys gotta understand it's the internet, man. It's the internet. It's the internet. Okay. It's the internet. You see, you see this? You see this, guys? You see this? It's a keyboard. Welcome to 2023, boys and girls. Oh, did I just mess up? Oh, dude. I thought I was like, dude. Hold on. My keyboard just messed up. Okay, there it is. Um on that on the one stream, didn't know what to do. Um You know, you, uh, you saw it, Raph. I appreciate it. Uh, you don't, you don't care about your, he don't care about his followers. Um, what's his name? I don't even know how to fuck to say your name, dude. Can we just fucking clip that dude? Just clip that dude. Just clip that dude. Keeps fucking crying. <clears throat> Uh, imagine being um, so unoriginal and, and full of hate that your entire channel is based off someone uh, else's content. Yeah, it's all good. It's all Gucci. It's all Gucci. It's all Gucci. I'm not, like I said, I'm not, I'm not really worried about it. It's just people keep bringing it up. Do you know if uh, Stussy's at 10 a.m. Eastern time or PST? Stussy, sneaker mom? St um, Stussy? You're like the first person to ask about Stussy. You're literally the first person to talk about Stussy. I don't know. I haven't bought anything from uh, uh, Stussy in a long time. I haven't bought from anything from Stussy in a long time. I'm not going to lie to you. Stussy. Um, if anybody is familiar of Stussy... Can you ask sneaker or give sneaker mom some advice about a Stussy? I don't not 100% sure This will never go away. It won't bro. It's the internet Stussy PST I believe okay Wes says 10 a.m. PST Appreciate what you do can't wait for the uh, hatch that's my boy El Migos uh, Not good I do is pretty funny, but uh, F that guy lol. Yeah Stussy is 10 a.m. PST. She changed the subject. Uh, she changed things, but this sounds like da 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 I da 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 
You guys are literally watching my hair grow. But by the way, we got the collection family hats. Um, the brown one. I think I showed it yesterday. As you guys can see. Collection family brown hats. We got a full box of them. We literally got a full box um, of them in. This is my note. We literally got a full box. So anybody need a hat? We're going to work on the website this over the weekend. We got tons. Tons of them. Tons. Full. We got a hundred of them. More. Who wants one? The brown ones are nice. I'm telling you guys. This is going to be my project of the weekend. Trying to figure out websites. Got to get like shipping boxes. Got to get a lot of stuff to get this ready. But we, we, uh, I'm ready. I'm ready for this drop. I don't know if you guys are ready for this. Drop the link. Drop the link. Uh, <clears throat> hook it up. I'll wear. Can I get the sneaky link? You can get the sneaky link. You get the sneaky. We need a beanie. I need black. Um, I need the backdoor link for the hats. Yeah, drop them. I'll take one for sure. Yeah, like I said, we have two different ones. Guys, we got two different ones. We got two different ones. Like I said, we got a brown one. We got a black one. Drew, thank you so much for the two. This is wrench, wrench, wrench. Uh, plus a hat on on Bob on Bob's di uh, on Bob's dime. Drew says, "Oh gosh." So we got this one, and we got the brown one. This one stitched on there. Look at that, beautiful. It's stitched on there, beautifully. You guys can see it. It's the back side of that. And then this one right here. The black one is nice, man. I love this black one, dude. This logo came out perfect. So there's that one for you guys. If you guys like this. Really, really nice. Uh, anyone going for the uh, Tina J's Air Force Ones? Yeah, I know some people in here are going for the Tina J's this morning. Tina J's, we got the Tina J's, we got the Air Force Ones, uh, Air Force Ones, Tina J's, we got the Dunks as well, dropping as well. So these are going to be dropping at uh, 10 Eastern time. Um, Rafi, it says uh, connection, fa uh, connection fa family. Oh, it doesn't, bro. Bro, you got me tweaking, bro. Connection family. I was like, what the heck? At first, you made me look right there for a second. Bro, powder blue or black toe air Jordan 1 lows? Um, uh, powder blues or Jordan toe Jordan 1 lows? I'm not sure on that one. Um, Yes, I got EA for the Tina J's. There we go. Rafi, I think you should swap out the white center of the, uh, the hats for gray or a color that doesn't uh, dirty so easily. I usually go for the darker hats. Uh, I mean, I guess. I mean, they're just black and white, bro. They're just black and white. There's not much that you could, like, really do. You know what I'm saying? Like, just don't get your hat dirty. You feel me? <laughs> just don't get your hat dirty. You know, I'm hoping that your hat stays on your head. You know what I'm saying? Uh, it's now Rafi and Scott. Get it right, people. What up, Parking Soul? Uh, parking uh, Parquet collects, uh, Collectibles was good, bro. How you doing, man? The black and white one was perfect just because black and white goes with everything. I just think brown was perfect. Perfect because if you have any brown shoes or any earthy tone colors, this could go well with anything. And it's just simple. Nothing crazy around the hat. Just says collection family stitched. So it's just perfect. You know what I'm saying? It's just perfect. 
it's just perfect you know the fit is perfect i love it and hopefully i know a lot of you guys are definitely gonna enjoy the hat once you guys get yours in so um we need the friends and family on the hat yeah bro uh our dropped um um into his stomach yeah bro because imagine if that was all wrong bro imagine that was all wrong uh Rafi, you accept apple pay um i don't know what we're gonna do um on the website i think i don't know if it's gonna be a shopify site i mean i could run the website as a shopify um we could do that to make it easier and i think that will give you guys the option to um um use apple pay or whatever whatever it is but i have to look into it domain change for your website they're one size fit most um there's not gonna be a domain there's only gonna be one domain it's gonna be one domain there's no need then there's there there's no need to like make a whole domain page like two different domains for the website i think you guys should be able to get yourself a hat if you guys want them okay that's all i gotta say like i think i'm gonna drop it on discord for um <clears throat> I think I'm going to drop it on Discord for members only to access the hats first, and then we'll have the public release. But the thing is, what I'm scared about is that if I drop them on the Discord first, they will sell out before I even go live on YouTube talking about it. So it, it depends. I guess it just depends. <laughs> Cause like, what if I drop the link on discord and it sells out and then everybody else that wants one that's in the chat won't be able to get one. <laughs> you feel me? That's the, that's the only thing that's going to suck. And everybody in the chat is like, oh, Ravi backdoored all his hats. They're like, Ravi backdoored all his hats. He's not, he, 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 no one gets one. You feel me? That's the shitty part. So I don't know how we're going to do it. I don't know how we're going to do this. That's my ultimate fear is that dropping it on the discord link to the group and then the stock goes away. Uh, should go to members only uh, anyways, in my opinion. Well, that's the general chat. Like, I would post in the general chat because the only people that could see general chat is members only. <clears throat> Scratch and sniff EA, Assad says. All I know, it's going to, it's going to be less than 200 hats. That's all I got to know. It's going to be less than 200 hats dropping. So if I think about it, if it's two, if it's less than 200 hats dropping, right? And then most of you guys buy both. That's like, oh my gosh, I don't know. Because you got two options, right? You got two options of hats. All I got to say, the most limited one is going to be the brown ones. The most limited ones is going to be my brown ones. Um, Respectfully, I don't think they uh, will sell out. I mean, we'll see, bro. We'll see. I'm hoping that everybody gets their gets their uh, gets their hats, man. On the real do beanies next perfect for the upcoming season. Yeah, I mean, we're we're basically in the winter season. Well, where I live, it's freaking cold. So I feel like it's once it's like September, October, it's like winter. Need red October next uh, next year name to buy. Will you take a payment plan? Oh my gosh. Um, no members are going to be first. That's the thing. Members are going to be, members are going to be first. So we're going to, I'm going to post it on the discord regardless. <laughs> did you get EA for the Royal reimagined? Uh, no, I did not. Uh, why trucker hat? Not a regular. Oh, it's because I'd be rocking trucker hats, man. I've been rocking trucker hats for a minute. I mean, I think the next up is going to be a regular hat. If you want to know what's next, I think it's this. 
Ah, uh, shoot. I don't know where it's at. I don't know where my blank's at. If you want to know what's next, it's this one right here. Shout out to Maria. Thank you so much for the five. Can I get a uh, hoya for the back door bear? Huge W. Um, uh, that goofball is just mad that he took an L on sneakers like the rest of us. Oh, no. I appreciate that. Thank you so much for the $5 donation. Is it Mar Mariano? My bad. He didn't show his whole name. Mariano Gonzalez. There it is. Mario Ga Mariano Gonzalez. I think this is up next right here. I think this is we just I got this blank not too long like a while back ago. I think this might be up next. I need to figure out a freaking patch. That's what I need to figure out. I want a patch on the next one. Like a patch on the side. But this is what we're looking at. Is that um I like the one that you got in hand. Yeah. So my idea, so the ones that are in here, my idea for the next one is having a patch on the side, right? It's having a patch on the side and the um, the fear of God, you know, the fear of God logo, but R in the middle right there, like R. Just R right there and then a patch on the side. That's our, that's our thought. <clears throat> Too much white. Uh, JD Gigs, thank you so much for the 20 month re up. Have you mentioned how we get access to the collection family hats? Um, it's, I think, I think it's going to be members only first. Uh, we're going to do members only first, I think. Member, um, uh, members only, members only, members only. Um, and then whatever, whatever doesn't sell out, we'll sell it to the public. Got my university red and white Jordan 1 Lowe's yesterday. Put your logo on the side patch. We could. We could. We definitely could do that. We could definitely do that. We could definitely do that. Stock numbers on the dunks. Uh, we got roughly about 20 minutes. Roughly about 24 minutes chat. Um, stock numbers on the dunks is 40,000. 40,000. 40,000. All right, 40,000. All right, let's run it up. Who's going to be our 200 like in the chat? If you guys don't mind, run it up. If you're new here, make sure you guys are subscribed to the channel. I greatly appreciate you guys coming through as always. Hit that like button. All right, hit that like button. It really does go a long way when you guys do. Um, Next, what do we have next week, chat? We got cherries. Where's all the cherries, people? Tomorrow, anybody going for these tomorrow? Anybody going for these tomorrow? Respectfully, like, like cop or drop on these tomorrow. Uh, what up, straight to toe? What up, my boy? How you doing, my guy? Anybody going for these tomorrow? The Jordan One Zoom Air CMFT twos. Anybody going for these? Let me know in the chat. I'm actually curious if anybody's going for this. The packaging is actually not too bad, but like the shoe itself is like meh. I feel like there's just so much going on with the sneaker. <laughs> Anybody going for these tomorrow? This is dropping tomorrow. I think this is a huge drop for me. Influence, what's good, bro? I'm staying in bed. Drop for me. Drop, drop, drop. Cop for sure, Big Draw says. Man, I don't know about how I feel about this. Going for them? Oh, yeah, going for the Day of the Dead. Uh, highs, okay, drop. Idiots. There's way too much going on with this. Yeah. High concept design like the um, go best with the uh, with this SBs. Kind of weird on the Jordan 1s. No, I'm cool. Okay. Seems like most of you guys are skipping on this. I'm passing on this heavy. Dude, sneakers at the end of October is kind of like meh. Dunk lows. I'm not a big fan. Next week, we got the Chris Pauls. We got these dunks, and then we got the Cherry 12s. Cherry 12s EA is going to be next week. Next week, Wednesday and Thursday. Next week, Wednesday and Thursday is EA for the Cherry 12s. And then we got Royals in November. 
hopefully November is a little bit better too. Because like November, we're getting in cherry 12s, right? November, we got cherry 12s. We got Aprils. We got Shock Drop on the Jordan 11 Gratitudes. And then I don't know what else. Oh, yeah, we have Amma Manier Jordan 5s. Um, I have them already. Definitely surprised when I get them. Uh, really nice details. Dude, I don't know. I, I don't know what else I'm 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 missing for the month of November. I don't know what else I'm missing. I think there's more stuff, but I can't. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I can't think right now. I like the red panda dunks. I'm a cop those. Rafi, did you go for the Royals ones? I didn't get I get I didn't get EA. I didn't get EA yesterday. That's the thing. I did not get exclusive access on the um I did not get EA yesterday. For the Royals. I did not get EA. Um Black Gums or Fogs SBs. Black Gums or Fog SBs Raph. Wait, what? Black Gums or Fog SBs? They're are, does, isn't that the same shoe there, Dexter? Wheat 13s in November. Okay. Fear th the Freer Jordan 3s. Cherry 12 selling out. I don't know. Parham. Parham thinks Cherry 12s are going to sit on the Nike sneakers app next week. <laughs> That's what Parham thinks. Aram thinks that Cherry 12s are sitting next week. Yes or no? No, they're not the same? Okay. No black gums are different? Okay, black gums are different. Different shoe? Okay. But fogs are better? Okay. I didn't, I didn't know what, what was what. It just sounded the same. Oh, he's talking about the one with the white check mark. Okay. No way. He's selling out. Will the Cherry 12s be profitable? No. I don't think they will. Selling out? No way. No. Some sizes might. I think, I think they're selling out. Me personally, I think Cherry 12s are going to sell out. I personally think the Cherry Jordan 12s are going to sell out. Uh, 40,000, 40,000 is, is the stock numbers on the, uh, on the SBs, 40,000, 40,000 pairs. SB lows will always sell out. Well, we're talking about cherries. I think cherries are going to sell out, man. Listen, chat. Just listen, just because just because a shoe doesn't go for anything in the resale market doesn't mean there's no demand. I've been saying this, man. Just because there's no resale doesn't mean there's no demand. Bigger sizes, but not smaller sizes. Yeah, I think bigger sizes will definitely fly on the cherries. I think bigger sizes will definitely uh, fly, but smaller size, I think it's going to slowly but surely sell out. Okay, and that's my personal opinion. OG heads have been waiting forever for Cherry 12s. I mean, the last time they dropped was what, 2013? They will sell out on sneakers, then get pushed on uh, and get pushed out on Nike app. Oh, no. <coughs> cherries are my or or origin story. I'm good on cherries, man. I, I I'm gonna pass on these in my person. Like that's just me. I don't have any twelves in my sneaker collection, respectfully. Um, I personally like the French blues better, but cherry twelve, sure, if you guys want them. But it that's like that's what I said. But the GRs like nowadays, it's like it's nice because you could always get them later if you want to skip on them now. Uh, I can tell you right now that the red is going to bleed over the white. What's the material on this? Is this leather on the upper, I'm assuming? You're you're saying that the red right here is going to bleed over the white, Assad said. Is that what, you, is that what you're saying? The red is going to bleed over the white leather on the upper? Uh, damn, Rav, hearing your voice makes me want to clear my throat, bro. Hope you feel better ASAP. Yeah, 
I think over the weekend, I'm your voice though sounded like a cowboy kid at Walmart. Yeah, I know. It's because I'm sick, dude. I'm sick. I'm sorry. It's not much that I could do. My head feels better, but like my uh, my freaking my freaking throat doesn't. I'll pass on the cherries and the black SBs, but that's the collection fam hat. Um, how's it gonna bleed over unless you hold them upside down? <laughs> Um, I, I don't know. I, I don't, I don't, I mean, people already have their cherry 12s. I don't personally think it will bleed. I've never seen a cherry. I've never seen, not a cherry, but I've never seen like a Jordan 12, um, all the way bleed over the leather. I've never seen that before. <laughs> Physics doesn't allow that to happen. I don't know. Guess. I don't know. You going for the Carhartt New Balances, Raph? I don't even know what time this drops. Oh, no. They're they're dropping at 10. They're dropping at 10 Eastern time. You talking about New Balances? New Balances drop at 10 a.m. EST. I just got a notification from Sneakers. Just got a notification from Sneakers. Well, Amma Munir was a little bit different, I think. Amma Munir had a total different material, though. Right? I don't know. I don't I don't think I would base the whole, like, bleeding over compared to the Amma Munir. Amma Munir, I think it's just had different material the way it was made. This this shoe, this Cherry 12, is made like all the other 12s that released in the past. In my personal opinion. But I think with the Cherry 12, or excuse me, with the Amal Manier 12s, it was all it was a totally different material on both on both on both Mudguard. Both Mudguard and the upper. God, my voice is terrible right now, dude. My throat is hurting. Um <clears throat> Do you have the stock numbers on the Fogs? It's 30,000, my guy. Or 40,000, excuse me. 40,000 on Fogs. Yeah, leather versus suede, exactly. Because I think I think with the uh, Amal Manier 12s, it was suede. Cherry 12s are so good in hand. Uh, Vortice says, okay, French Blues are in great condition. Well, French Blue 12s is the same material that they put on these uh, cherries, it looks like. Cherry 12s had really good tumble leather on the upper when they first dropped, or the last time that they dropped. Mm. Lots of bounce bled. Hope it doesn't bleed, uh, bleed because quality control been butt. Yeah, I mean, I guess it just depends on your pair. <laughs> Go get something to drink, Raf. I know, I, I ran out of orange juice. I was drinking orange juice all freaking morning. All morning, but we got about 13 more minutes chat 13 more minutes if you guys don't mind smash that like button if you guys do not mind man Let's run it up real quick hit that like button subscribe to the channel if you guys are new here I greatly appreciate you guys like I said uh, for tapping in as always. All right um, It's freaking Friday. Um, I'm excited. I'm sure my daughter's excited. That it's Friday um and I'm hoping that you guys can get through your Friday, man. I'm sorry that I didn't stream all day yesterday. If you guys end up getting exclusive access on the Royal Reimagines, congratulations. Um, <clears throat> um you can ex uh, Rafi get you, uh, get you some. Well, I yesterday, yesterday I ended up getting uh, what did I get yesterday? My girl got me um thermal flu yesterday, and that that somewhat helped me. But the thing is, you know what sucks? Sleeping by the window. Does anybody get that when you like sleep by the window and then like when it's like cold, like your throat kind of your your throat kind of, you know, I don't know how to how. Uh, I don't know how to explain it, but like for some reason, every time I sleep like by the window, like I feel like my that's where I get sick. I don't know if that makes any sense. I don't know if you guys get what get my Jeff, but. Um, New Balance 990s V6 Carhartt time. Yeah, uh, base Maryland. Good luck if you're going for them, my guy. Spider Man is whack. 
all about Doctor Strange. <coughs> thermal flu, not uh, thermal flu, thorough flu, whatever, thorough flu, whatever, thermal flu, th same shit. I'm fob, fresh out the boat. Um, I slept with the uh, by the window, window, uh, by the window last night. I slept by the window last night. Okay. You slept by the open window last night. I never opened my window, bro. Never. Ugh. I don't like the outside smell, if that makes sense. Like, when I open my window, i rather have just AC. Like, I don't know. I don't know how to explain that. I fell asleep in front of the... Um, uh conditioner once uh the air conditioner once and woke up sick lol quarter of hot tea half of lemon shot of whiskey dude the whiskey thing is actually a thing is crazy the whiskey thing that you guys brought up is it's crazy how like that's actually a thing and bob's been saying that since day one how like it's actually a thing I slept on the couch. Motherfucker hates fresh air. <laughs> Yo. Everyone has weird remedies. Yeah, exactly. Everyone does, dude. It's fine. Clean your pillow pillowcase. Yo, does anybody get... Like, when do you guys ever get new pillows? No disrespect to the shoe, but the Cherry 12s reminds me of the shoe scene from Roger a Rabbit. The scene where he puts it into the to the toxic waste. Oh, no. Yo, chat. When do you guys when do you guys get new pillows? Does anybody like does anybody get like new pillows on the daily basis? Like like maybe every other month that you guys get a new pillow or maybe like every other two months that you guys get new pillows like. Or do you guys stick with your pillows? Or how long you guys been having your pillows for like six, seven, eight years? It's called a hot toddy. Every Saturday I get a new pillow. I buy new pillows every six month ish. Okay. Every eight months, G. Okay. Every five years. Man says he gets a new pillow every five years, bro. New pillow every December, every six months. I flip my pillow over and it's new. <laughs> Yo, three years. Got to ask the wifey that question. Only when I misplace my pillow. Seven years is gross. Sell all them dead skin cells. <laughs> Like, so your pants is like once a decade. Oh my gosh. <coughs> uh, still sleep with my baby pill, LMAO. Every president election, get new pillows. Like, I get new underwear every three years. Some of y'all, some of y'all use pillows as women. It depends on the stains. I get new pillowcases, but keep the pillow. I didn't think you uh, had to change them. <laughs> oh, my gosh. How do you lose your pillow? I don't know. Dude, when my pillow gets too hot, dude, I freaking throw that shit on the ground, dude. Let that shit cool off. And then you bring it back up to your to your bed. Sound like I'm like fucking. It sounds like I need fucking a, a step ladder to get on my fucking bed the way I sounded like. Throw it on the bed and bring it back up. You know what? I had a coworker. Listen, I had a coworker that still from this day, guys, from this day, him and his wife share a full size bed. You know, there's a full, a twin size, full size, queen, king, California king, right? This man, him and his wife. 
share a full size bed. I'm like, why? I was like, why don't you just get a queen bed? He's like, well, the reason why I told my wife I would never change our bed to a queen size bed or a king size, so it forces her to cuddle with me. No, they're not skinny. They're not skinny. They're not skinny. Dude, I don't think I would ever be able to share a full-size bed. So like I said, it goes twin, full, queen, king. They're not little, bro. This dude is like, this guy is like, he's five foot eleven, six feet at least. I think he's six foot, six foot, six foot one. And his wife is like five foot seven. And they're sharing a fucking full size bed, dude. He says that he'll never change his bed. So his wife forces him to cuddle with him every night. I was like, what the? He was serious, Jack. <laughs> I'm sorry, bro. Like if I was single, just me and my, me and my wife, with no, like, if we were kids, like, with no kids, okay, with no kids, bro, like, uh, still, we're, we're, we're buying a queen, at least a queen size bed. There's no way I'm sharing a full size bed with my wife. He likes to cuddle. I was like, so I asked him, I was like, what if it's like 90 degrees outside? He's like, well, then we're, we're, we're cuddling with each other with sweat. I'm like, that's disgusting. <laughs> Like, for me, if I get, I don't know if you guys get naturally sweaty. I, me, personally, I don't get naturally sweaty. Like, like I know, friend, I have friends that just get naturally sweaty. Like, they're just drenched in sweat. Like, naturally at night. Like, ugh. I don't want any anyone near me when I sleep. <laughs> Relationships last longer with separated beds. <laughs> my wife and I have separate rooms. I sleep with my sneaker collection. Why would you why would you wait why? Why would you sleep at a different room? Like, why? I mean, I, I know, I know, I know married couples that sleep in separate rooms. I know, I know, listen, I know a couple, couple a couple married couples that sleep in separate rooms. Studies have proven couples last longer with their own space. Well, even if you're you're saying you even if you're married, they're Stegenboro. Alright, three minutes. Three minutes. This is an interesting topic, dude. Some of you guys are like, yeah, married or not. We have a king size and my dog doesn't understand personal space. I have a friend who's married with two kids and they live in separate houses. Like, what? I have a friend who's married with two kids and they 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 live in separate houses. What the what the hell? What kind of relationship is that? 40,000 chat, 40,000, 40,000 on the stocks, on the, uh, on the dunks, married couple sleeping at sip, what they're called roommates. You know, I, I should, should I, should I, should I bring that? Should I bring up that to my girl? Be like, Hey babe, let's, uh, let's sleep in different rooms for a week and see how you feel. My, my girl would kill me if I do that. She's probably going to think I'm cheating. My girl's probably going to think I'm cheating if I decide to lay, hey, babe, let's sleep in separate rooms. Two minutes, two minutes, two minutes, Chad, two minutes. There's my dream married and living separate. See you when I see you. That is such a weird mindset. <laughs> 
that is such a weird mindset. No offense. I'm not, I'm not trying to like, but that is so weird though. That is so fucking weird. Who's married in here? Where's all my married couples in here? Where's all my, we need therapy. We need relationship therapy right now. <laughs> Bro, I am 35 years old, baby. I sleep on top of my wife. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> All right, here we go. Here we go, chat. Here we go. Cue's up. I'm not listen, I'm not judging anybody. I'm not judging anybody. It's just like, bro, like <laughs> We're basically in a like a, a relationship therapy right now. Everyone has just their different mindsets of marriage, I guess. I don't know. Hey, Raph, you think my little brother should get married because he got his girlfriend pregnant? No. That's always what people think. Like, I mean, it just depends on your like, whatever, man. Do whatever you want. I don't know. All right, here we go. It's live. Good luck. Good luck. Uh yeah, we're we're gonna wait. Why is it not letting me go for it? App is glitching out. Anybody's app is glitching. My app is glitching on me. There it goes. Let me know once you guys are pending. Let me know once you guys are pending. <clears throat> All right, there it is. Pending. Pending, 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 pending. Let me know once you guys are pending. Let me know once you guys are pending. Fuck, oh, I hurt. I just hurt my knee. Ow. Let me know once you guys are pending. All right, once you guys are pending, let me know. There it is. I'm pending. Pending for a size 13 for Mr. Exclusive. Penning, 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 penning. Uh, if you guys want the job, Morantz, I think they dropped on finish line. Let me know once you guys are penning. Run it up real quick. Let's get to 300 likes. If you guys are new here, make sure you guys are subscribed to the channel. Uh, I greatly appreciate you guys uh, for coming through as always. Uh, 40,000 on the stock numbers on the, uh, on the dunks. So if you guys are going for them, good freaking luck. Pending, pending, pending. <clears throat> Pending, 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 pending. Let me know in the chat. Run it up real quick. Let me know. Oh, by the way, New Balance as well. New Balance. New Balance as well. If anybody's going for New Balance, Car Hearts. Uh, good luck that as. Uh, good luck on that as well. I'm still pending, chat. We'll see if we get a W or now. We'll see here. Pending, pending, pending. I'm We'll see if we get it for Mr. Exclusive. We'll see. Here we go. Uh, why aren't you going for your size? Uh, I, I'm the, I already have the Supremes. I'm good on these. Uh, Mr. Exclusive wants a size 13. Mr. Exclusive wants a size 13. Well, if I hit on this, it's all I always hit uh, only for people's sizes, bro. Pending on my pull-out sofa bed. Pending on... Let me know once you guys are pending. If you guys hit, let me know in the chat. One hour wait. Got a 14. Good luck. Good luck. Good luck. Got him. Got him. I'm still pending. Still pending. W. Still pending. Go, 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 go. Got me on a six and a half. Oh, Mr. Exclusive. I got him, bro. <laughs> Yo, Mr. Exclusive. I got him. I got him. I got him. Dude, I freaking hit my knee hella hard. Mr. Exclusive. I got him. Wow. I got him. See, why is it I always hit on someone else's size, bro? Like, this makes no sense. 
I always hit on people's sizes. Size 13. Is that what you needed, right? Size 13? Got him. You would have hit uh, hit in your size. There was only like 2,000 pairs in a size 13, dude. Size in a size 10. There you go. Dumb in a size 10. There you go. Sneaker hates me. Dude, it's, it's so weird that I only hit on people's sizes, bro. It makes zero sense. I always hit on people's sizes, bro. Uh, Mr. Exclusive, did you take an L? Zach, did you take an L or what? We got him. I was reconnecting for a little bit. I don't know what happened there. Did you guys see me? Uh, did you guys see me lagging for a little bit? Was I lagging for a little bit? <coughs> Took my 13 raft. Well, I'm gonna sell it for uh, retail for Mr. Exclusive. He wanted these. Um, yeah, I froze for a little bit. Oh man, because I got my invoice cooked. Yeah, you lagged for a second. Okay. I think I'm good now. I saw I saw myself reconnecting for a little bit, but I think I was fine. Um, it's only JD. Uh I took an L on the size 11. I've tried 11. It, well, it's listen, guys. It is uh what's it called? First come, first serve. Let me see. Finish line. Oh my gosh. Those Jordan 4s restocked on finish line, too. Those Jordan 4s, those Jordan 4s, they restock. What are these Jordan 5s, bro? These Jordan 5s are hideous. Um, shout out to SSJ. Thank you so much for the two. I took an L on my size 13. Thanks to you, LMAO. Hey, I, I went for Mr. Exclusive, all right? That's what I was doing. I went for Mr. Exclusive, and I hit for him. So I dude, it's I don't get how this is it's this easy to hit on someone else's size, but I can never hit on my own. It makes zero sense. Uh Jordan 4 is gone on JD Sports. Okay. <coughs> Mr. Exclusive, thank you so much for the five dollar donation. Took four L's. Thank you, Ravi. Oh wow. See, look at that. At least I can help people, all right? There you go. Mr. Exclusive, I'm glad that I could help you out. There you go. Purchase, too. Look, I even got the purchase button on my desktop. Over 15K on new balances. New balances, I got two-minute wait. Two hundred and I'm 278th 78th in line. Uh, L on a size 30, 11, glitching on uh, till to 10.03. Let me know if you guys end up hitting. Let me know if you guys end up hitting. Your boy end up taking a W on the uh, Dunk Fogs. Not easy for a size 13. Let me verify I got your size, by the way. Let me see if I could verify. I got a size 13 men's. 13 men's, my friend. There you go. 13 men's. There you go. Uh, I'll send you the uh, I'll send you the uh, the confirmation there, uh, Mister Exclusive. <laughs> I'll send you the confirmation. Get on a size ten. So happy. There you go. Got him. Got him. W in a size twelve. There you go. W W in a size nine and a half. L on a ten and a half. Sold on a nine and a half. L sold out. It's uh, is it out? Is it gone? Size thirteen. Thanks to you now. Let's see. Um, Nike sneakers app. Is it all gone? It's sold out. It's gone. Everything's sold out. 40,000. I think it was a total stock Took on four these. L's. Thank you, Raph. Fire. There it is. Clip, clip. L on a size 8.5. Uh, w on a size 11. There you go. You like these or the uh, black gums bottoms better? Um, I don't know. I, I, I already have the Supreme, so I didn't really need these. Um, But there you go. I mean, I, I'm glad that I could help somebody out in the chat. You feel me? I'm glad that I could help people in the chat, man. All right? It's just, it just, <coughs> it feels good. It feels good, but it doesn't feel good on hitting SBs on sneakers app because I can't hit my size. Like, that's crazy, man, how, how easy it was to hit on a size 13, but I can't even hit my own damn size. 
Looks like the undefeated dunks. My count is on fire. I hit on the past five drops. It's unbelievable. There you go. There you go. Congrats. I just missed the drop. If you didn't hit and still want them, they're a um, they're a, around forty dollars above retail on StockX. If you need them, W in a size four, hit three size elevens. There we go. Uh, took an L, W in a size eleven. My first pair of SB dunk lows. Congratulations. Glad that a lot of you guys could hit for the first time. It is a good feeling when you see people actually hitting on SB dunks for the first time. It really is. It's a really good feeling that a lot of you guys could hit. Um, and I, I feel like with this year in 2023, uh, for SB dunk lows, if you end up like taking an L on an SB, it's nice that you could go back and, you know, buy them again if you want them, you know, cause they're all affordable. Like this shoe doesn't go for much. Someone said they go for like 30 over retail. So that's not bad. I haven't hit anything since playoff 13 shock drop. Okay. My 11 and a half on my mom's account. My second SB dunk lows. I'm happy AF. There we go. Congrats to all the W's, dude. I'm like scratching my head. I'm like, dude, I can't believe I just hit on that size 13. That size 13, I can't believe I hit. I missed the past three drops. Sneakers playing with me. My last W's, dude. This is my new account from this year. My last W's was those candy corns. I ended up hitting on those candy corns on my dad's size. Um... Uh, let's see. I end up hitting on the satins, um, and then the Spider Mans this year, and then the Run the Jewels. Those are all my Ws this year. Uh, SBs versus regular dunk sizing. SBs, depending for this one, I would say they run half size small, so you would go a half size up, um, because they run small. Uh, if they have the regular, you know, regular tongue like the skinny tongue, then go true to size. But it just depends on the shoe. Hopefully, they'll all make it out the uh, warehouse. Not kidding, it's very bad right now. It seems to uh, always hit Kobe's and SB's. Everything else, not so much. Okay, I guess ink is all based off luck for sure. Everything on the Nike sneakers app is everything is all based out of luck. Uh, one fifty six, one hundred fifty six dollars on stock X, but one eighty. 180 after tax. Okay. I hit on Travis and Jay Balvin's, but I can't hit SBs. Yeah, SBs. I feel like the SBs in general, the demand for SBs are always higher. Um, well, now I'm not saying higher than all the other ones. I mean, it's just because depending on the stock numbers, there was 40,000, 40,000 pairs on these stock numbers on these uh, on these SBs. 40,000. 40,000 pairs, chat. 40,000, which 40,000 is pretty average, I would say. 40,000 is not bad. 40,000 is not bad in my personal opinion. 40,000. Uh, New Balance bigger size sold out in 11 and up. Uh, let's check it out. Here we go. Got through. These New Balances, me personally, I'm not a big fan. Anybody going for New Balances? Oh, there it goes. So... Size 15, 16, 8 through a size 10 is still available. You guys like these? It's in my cart. Oh, there's nothing in my cart. You guys like these? Anybody go for the new balances? There's some size is still available. Only size 8 or size 4 through a 10, 15, and a 16. So that that's 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 what we have left for these uh for inventory. I like the silhouette. Um the colorway is eh. Um am I the only one that's watching a blurry screen? What do you mean? My my screen's blurry? I don't think my screen is blurry, my guy. Is my screen blurry, chat? Am I good? Am I is my screen fine, chat? Let me know. Gomina size nine man. There you go. Your screen is blurry. Yes. Try to refresh. It's in and out. Okay. It might be my, my my connection, dude. Please. Not blurry. Nope. Crystal clear. Okay. Maybe it's some people, some people not. Screen not blurry at all for me. Okay. I think it's just some other people's connections, maybe. I don't know. It's probably some people's connections. Refresh your screen. Yeah. It could be it's it, it could be some people's connections. Did anyone cop those University Red Jordan 1 lows last week? Uh, they're still sitting if you want a pair. Um, bro needs to change to uh, 1080p. That's probably what it is. 
Yo, Raf just wanted to say thank you for low uh, price Discord monitors. You would go, of course, man, of course, two dollars a month, man. I mean, you really can't go wrong with that. That's why I told you guys to make sure you guys are connecting your YouTube account into Discord. All right, make sure you guys are doing that. Connect your YouTube account into Discord. If you guys have not, make sure you guys are doing so. All right, that's very, very important. All right, connecting your YouTube account into Discord is highly important uh, for the group. All right, so you guys getting all those benefits. All right, uh, make sure you guys run it up, though. Let's run it up to 300 likes, man. It's freaking Friday, chat. Um, I don't know if anybody's going for the Tina J's. I know a lot of you guys are. Most of you guys I know is going for the Tina J's. <laughs> I know most of you guys are going for the Tina J's this morning, and that's not going to go live until noon Eastern time, I believe. Noon Eastern time. Noon Eastern time. You're good? Okay. Uh, I copped it. It seemed like nobody liked them. Where are the University Lows at? Uh, the ones that he's talking about is on Nike. Uh, he's probably talking about these ones right here. Let me show you these. It's all about these. Hey, where is it? Man, dude, Nike is so down bad with all these pairs. This is crazy, bro. Look at this. Jordan 1 low. Red University Reds sitting. These ones. These Jordan 1 highs. Full size, chat. The Mavs. Jordan 1 highs sitting. Pandas sitting. Jordan 1 satins. I mean, there's like one size left. 10 men's, but... Smaller sizes sitting. Crazy, man. Crazy. Mobs dust. Uh, these are just, I don't know. I think it's because this is just not a wearable shoe. It's not bad. It's just like no one really wears this colorway on the daily basis. Oh, shit. I need to re-up my, uh, my membership. Yeah, if you want to re-up. If you want to join the membership, it is linked. The link is, uh, the link is pinned. The link is pinned in the chat. Guys, I think I'm going to, you guys, you know what I'm going to rock this weekend on Sunday? I'm going to rock my, um, my Jordan 1 eyes. Uh, my re, not my reimagined by, but my, uh, what's it, what are those called? What are those red ones that I just pulled out not too long ago? I got to check the weather. The weather is like shitty today. Even though the, the weekend, I think I'm rocking this over the weekend. Man, I'm, the heritages, there it is. The heritages. That's what I'm going to rock over the weekend. The heritages. Thank you. Thank you. Tina, appreciate it. Tina V. Thank you so much for reminding me. That's what I'm rocking over the weekend is the um, is the heritages. What are we rocking over the weekend? What's the weekend fit, chat? What shoes are you breaking out over the weekend? What shoes are you guys breaking out for the weekend? Let me know in the chat. What shoes are you guys breaking out on the weekend? On the weekend. Elevates? No. <clears throat> uh lightning mcqueen crocs no idea yet okay that's fair i got the unc's to chicago's lows on the outlets last week for uh under 70 dollars uh sb fogs cherry 12s i think i'm wearing my custom dunks lightning mcqueen crocs maybe black toes there we go i'm a Meniere's white and black airships currently wearing red panda dunks there we go pure money fours wow pure money fours huh Man said, I'm bringing out the pure money Jordan 4s. The man says, I am not kidding with you. Pure money Jordan 4s. Love to see it, though. Pure money 4s, huh? Pure money 4s. Pure money 4s. Um, it's raining in Cleveland. Uh, Red cement Jordan 4s. What the Tina J's look like? You don't know what the Tina J's look like, my guy? These are the Tina J's. Let me show you, my guy. Tina J's. Tina J's. Where are those Tina J's at? These are what the Tina J's look like. I don't know if anybody has an early review on the Tina J's. Right here. This is live. We are here for the sixth episode of Dot Swoosh Sessions at WHQ out of Beaverton, Oregon. What's up, everybody? I'm Bryce Wong, virtual and physical collections creation and designer for Virtual Studios. You do the honors here. Bring them out. This is the Air Force One Low Tina J. Tina J is actually, this is not a JPEG. First physical release, something we're super proud of. When you see it on the street, you're like, you know where that's from. Not being a JPEG, we had to throw a JPEG on here. How did we end up with this shoe right here, the Air Force One Low Tina J? We wanted to make sure that the first shoe that we came out with really told our story. Color palette is all based off of the dots. 
Robert Robinson, thank you so much for the one month re up, bro. Welcome, bro. Welcome to the collection family, man. Appreciate you, my guy. Robert, make sure you uh, connect your YouTube account to Discord, all right? Swoosh virtual team. <clears throat> I want the shoe, Bryce. How do I get it? I wish we had like a flow chart or something. Will I get access to the Air Force One low Tina J? Are you a Dot Swoosh member? Yes. Yes. Okay, so far so good. If you are not a Dot Swoosh member, right off the bat, that is going to put you at a disadvantage because you are going to need to be a Dot Swoosh member in order to get it. Did you purchase an OF1 box? I did. Yes. Okay, so you are continuing to get closer to this is where we want to end up. You want to end up on your end. Did you purchase an OF1 box? No. Unfortunately, that's okay. Your choice. But that is going to exclude you from getting access to the Tina J. Did you reveal at least one OF1 box, Bryce? I did. You're in. You did. It. In. You're in. You're in. Oh. Congratulations, Bryce. So the thing is, like, I, I think you think you that's a marketing been... move on Nike where, like, you get, uh, you purchase. You're like one of those, uh, you know, a swoosh member, right? And then you purchase on the OF1 box. It's it's like you get exclusive, like you get exclusive shoes. You think that's like a marketing move on Nike <coughs> to force people to purchase that? You feel me? Added to the list of people who will be getting the chance to purchase this on the sneakers app on October 20th. Bryce, when's it coming out? October 20th on the sneakers app. Um, only for those members who have revealed at least one OF1 Dot box Swoosh's by booty. the 16th. Hey everyone, my name is Dan Sunwoo, Senior Director of Virtual uh, Creation and Curation. Yep. Um, our team is part of the creative team that brings our virtual and we're creating these collections for the gamers and the collectors. We're going to be dropping for free digital doubles and people's dots. I think the shoe is not bad. I, I, I They're definitely growing on me a bit. Yeah, they had to buy that crap. Then you get stuff later. Yeah. Too much work. Uh, pay to win. Yeah, basically, that's what it is. Has to be. It's basically you pay to win. I, I think it's definitely a marketing move on Nike. So, like, you get these exclusive shoes. You know, in order to get these exclusive shoes that you have to, like, be, like, some sort of NFT holder. They just dropped in the EU. It's not a marketing move. It's just a utility for uh, buying the uh, OFM1 NFT. Yeah. It's kind of late to be uh, doing the NFT wave. Uh, so many people get scammed by that shit, bro. I don't like the thing is with NFT, like, I haven't really got into it that much. Like, I never really looked into it, you know? I've never really looked into it too much because do I care about it? I mean, not really. You know, I don't really care too much unless you're really invested into it. You know, it's all if you're invested into it. Sure. You know, but it's like it's just something that I I don't really need. Nothing good has uh, came out of the uh, dot swoosh. BS. I can even uh, hit on sneakers. <laughs> Uh, if you're actually into NFT and such, it's a super simple process, really. If uh, you're in uh, in NFT, it's pretty dope. I've made like 20k on NFTs, lol. Yeah, I guess if you really look into it and if you know what you're doing, you could make a lot of money off of it. I'm not saying that you can't, right? I'm not saying that you can, but you really have to really put your like put a lot of effort into it, um, in order to know what you're doing. But me personally, let's like stocks, right? It's like stocks, like getting into like whole like, uh, you know, uh, you know, selling and trading on the daily basis. Like I remember when I was working on my last job, like one of my bosses tried to get me into a crypto um, and try to get into all that, bro. It's so much work. Like it's so much work. Like mostly if you like um, if you're like a daily, uh, you know, daily buying and trading on the daily basis, then yeah, it's it's a lot of work. But if you're just like, all right, let me keep putting money into this, uh, invest into money into this in this coin or 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 crypto or something like that, then then sure, just throw your money in there and then hopefully it you know sp spikes up you know eventually, you know, um, XRP, tw dude, XRP has been one. Has been one that my like one of my bosses that I work for like has been telling me to put a lot of money into it for a, for a long time, and I was just like you know I was like you know what I'm just gonna leave it alone. I have money into XRP. I just don't look at it. Honestly, I barely uh, um, pay attention. I'm in a Discord group that just uh, tells me what to buy and what not to buy. I'm pretty it's uh, it's pretty awesome. I don't touch NFTs or even Discords on the. Am I good? Am I good? Am I good? 
Frozen, am I good? I think I'm good now. Hello? I think I'm good. Back, we're back, okay. Back, all right. We're back, all right. Here we go. Uh, back now, we back, okay. I told you guys my connect, dude, my internet, something's up with my internet. I might have to reset it or something. I might have to reset my internet. I don't know, I don't know if it's my computer. I don't know if it's my internet. I don't know what it is, chat. I'm telling you guys. I don't know if it's my internet or it's my computer. Your internet speed is slow and pixelated. Yeah, we might have to reset it. Like plug it, plug it out and plug it back in. I think that's what we have to do. Got that that backdoor plug. Dude, people think I was capping about my freaking internet, dude. I told you my internet's ass. But it's like the best of the best in my area, though. I have Xfinity. Anybody have Xfinity? <laughs> Ravi just got another got another link. Yeah, I know. Told you guys, like, it's like it happens, dude. And it's 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 happening today again. Uh, I hit on a size eleven. Uh, might have gotten that link for uh, Tina J's. Uh, right, right, exactly, right. I got the Tina J link. Who needs them? I got the Tina J link. Keep in mind though, we have in the uh that Canadian internet up the uh run for uh bipolar polar bears. Yeah, I have to tell my girl. I might have to tell my girl that she needs to unplug the internet and plug it back in. Cause it's been happening. It's been happening uh, of late. So sure it is. Yeah, sure it is. Sure it is. Yeah, your internet, sure it is, right? Um we have that Canadian internet up here, up by the polar bears. Yeah, well, I don't know. My well, the thing is, like, my friends were telling me that I should just switch to T-Mobile since I have T-Mobile now to just switch to their internet. Shit, I don't know how good T-Mobile internet is. Take a look at the uh, RTFK Dunks NFT that's being redeemed right now. Could be a YouTube problem too. Could be, but I don't think anybody else is. Uh, is having any problems shock drop later today i don't know if there's any more shock drops i don't know i didn't hear any any other shock drop news for today i don't know i didn't hear any shock drop news for today it's by nike uh or or google fiber i don't know i could try something new i could absolutely try something new for sure i could try something new but i don't know uh, but this weekend, chat, this weekend, we have the Jordan 1s, the Jordan 1s and Dunks. I don't know if any of you guys are going for it, okay? We got, we got drops tomorrow. I don't know if you guys are going for it. I don't know if it's worth going for. You guys let me know. Um, we got the Dunks and we got the Jordan 1 highs. I don't know. I don't know. Should we, should we call it off for the weekend? Because I'm still kind of sick. So maybe this is a good time I could try to get better. Uh, for this weekend, uh, but you guys let me know, okay? Uh, but other than that, man, I I'm gonna let you guys go on this fine weekend. Um, it's Friday, right? It's Friday. Nothing crazy happening. Uh, for today, other than the uh, Tina Tina J's at 9 a.m. PST, 12 Eastern time. Um, if you guys don't mind, please run it up real quick. Uh, let's run it up to 300 likes if you guys don't mind. Um, smash that like button if you guys are new here. Subscribe to the channel. Um, I really do appreciate you guys all tapping in. We hit on the SB Dunk Lows um, for Mr. Exclusive. So there you go. I'll hit you up today, Mr. Exclusive, uh, for that, uh, for the, uh, for the, um, for that invoice. All right. Well, make sure you guys run it up. Hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel. Uh, appreciate you guys hanging out with me. Um, I'm going to go get some, I'm going to drink some medicine, bro. And probably just go back to sleep or something so I can try, try to feel, feel better or whatnot. But you guys have a good weekend, man. All right. Have a good weekend. I'll see you guys next week for the CP3 uh, Jordan 1s lows. We got that next week. And then we got a bunch of other stuff uh, happening. So make sure you guys hit that like button. Like I said, on the way out, let's get to 300 likes. And I'll see you guys on the next one, man. Have a good weekend. Follow me on Twitter. Follow me on Instagram. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Have a good weekend. All right. Congratulations to all the W's. I'll see you guys, man. Run it up. Matter your peace.